All right, all right. So, apparently, most of you that are watching this video right now don't even know that Tubes++ Plus Plus is a thing or don't even know how to use it. And you may be thinking, what's so important about Tubes++? Plus Plus? Oh, nothing. It's not like it's the best tool for tubes with the Maker Pen by far. The best tool that will carry you from creating stuff using tube and will save you almost all the time when you make the slightest mistake or you want to make the slightest adjustment. It will save you so much time and it will make your objects that you're trying to create or whatever with the Maker Pen so much better because you have this tool and a lot of you don't even know it exists and you might be wondering what is it tubes plus plus it's these you see this dot that i'm you see these dots it's not the mimipoli tool it's not the Mimipoli tool, those are squares. These are dots. And what makes these more special, right? Well, you can do, well, you can delete individual parts. You can create more by inserting points between multiple selected points. So you can have it back. You can smoothen out the points. Like that. <laughs> and lastly, which I think is more important, you can change and move everything about these. Like, really. You can even change the scale. You can do that. That's probably one of the best parts about it. You can change the scale of these tubes and now you have more control of how they look like and it's a lot more easier when you know this and now it's as simple as that and you want to know how you access them follow me so first off you need to edit your object so you know the edit button right here yeah click on the edit button edit your object it could be multiple tubes it could be an object with a tube that's included in it you want to use tubes plus plus uh you see how the edit button pops right back up click on that again you got your pointer back and then select the tube and there's two plus plus your tubes plus plus is now activated on this exact tube which you can do whatever you want with it again select tool Select multiple tubes points at once. Options. Insert point. You can insert multiple points in between those multiple selected parts. It's, that's, uh, yeah, it's basically gist of it. You can smooth in, you can align it. Let's align it. I didn't align it yet. So you can align the position, size anything to the plane, position only. Boom, let's align it. Wow. It aligns together. It's all in a line. They were all spread out before, but not anymore. And I already showed you how smooth works, so... Yeah, that's really it about Tubes++. Plus Plus. And now you know it. But I want to show some examples. You know one of my favorite examples of building Tubes++ Plus Plus and trying to practice with it? making pots faces yeah those things so let's do that so you probably know what i'm talking about when i'm saying pots or vases well i want to create something wacky right so i want to create something like this i created this before it looks really nice right maybe not with all the additional like textures or the flowers but maybe the pot itself you see how it's like Woo, woo, woo. You know how I did that? Tubes plus plus. And that was the easiest part about it because Tubes plus plus is very forgiving. You don't need to do it in all in one run. You can always adjust it. So, we'll try to make something wacky like this. Alright, let's make 
two 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 pots. One of them very normal, right? What you would expect of anything. And then I'm gonna make a wavy one. Alright. So let me just start off with keeping my tube size small like this. Bring one up, bring two up, and we're just gonna only have two points at the start with. Which is three points, actually. We're going to move this upwards. We're going to move this one upwards as well. We can keep this one downwards a little. All right. Now, we're going to move, thicken this one up a bit. You see how we probably want more points thinking about it, right? Because, well, we don't really have enough points to make this pot. All right. Cool. So, we can insert a point here insert a point here probably want some more points so let's insert multiple points at once boom now we can adjust these following points scale them up individually and well look at that that's too big look at that Nice little pot, a little vase, a little jug. That's a basic one. Let's do a swiggly one, like I said now. Same idea. We're only going to start with two. Move one up. Move a second up. Keep the bottom one. Since I want to do multiple this time, I'm actually going to move this one down to the middle. Because I want it to be wavy, I'm going to immediately start inserting points. Selecting multiple and doing this. Select all five, select points. Look how many points I have now. Now, let's keep the bottom one the same size it is now. Scale up this part. Scale down this part. And then we can keep this one up here the same. Bring this one up. Bring one this one slightly down, but it still goes up. Bring this one down a little. And bring this second one down a lot more. And then let's just move the top one downwards up here. Okay, we got a cool little wavy pot design now. And that is how you use Tubes Plus Plus. I hope you followed along and you were able to learn something. Tubes Plus Plus, very important tool. Recommend it. Don't forget it. I Please, never forget it. It's really good. It's really good and helpful. All right. Now, with this information, go create some amazing stuff with Tubes. And see you next time. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.